Hi YouTube. Okay, so I promised that I would come back and show a video for when I got done braiding my hair and I'm done. Um, this is how it came out. Again, this was my alternative to crochet braids. I didn't really like, if you watch, well, you know what, I'm not even going to explain it. You got to go back and watch my other video as to why I did the alternative to the crochet braids. Um, it took me a while to upload after I was done because I've been done now for like two days. But I just hadn't got around to showing off the finished product. But this is the finished product. Um, I'll come in so you can see. Instead of me doing the braids as cornrows, I did them as the individual braids. Some would say micros. These are not micros. These are individual braids. They're smaller in the front, but and when I did in the back, they're bigger. I'll turn to the back so you all can see how it is. And here's the other side. I'm going to kind of do a little turn for you guys. Hopefully, I'm staying within the camera. And it came out. I love it. I, I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, it gives me the look that you get from the crochet braids but then there's also so many styles that I can do because it's individual braids and when I go to put it up I don't have to worry about the the corn rolls showing I don't have to worry about trying to slick down the baby hairs because y'all remember what I said if baby hair works for you you and you that's great baby hair does not work for Tiffany Leia okay so um, if y'all have any questions or anything I'm gonna be doing as I put up more styles or whatever um, if the mirror in front of me, I told you guys I can't stop looking in the mirror. Um, so I'm going to do, as I go through and do styles, um, I'll do some some tips. But it's really easy. Um, it's really, you know, you got to want to rock the big hair for this. Because I know some may say, oh, it's kind of full. I like big hair. I like the full look. You know, that's my thing. So, and it really, you know, it looks natural. So I'm going natural. I'm doing natural. So just adding in some hair just gives me, you know, a, a greater view of what's to come as my hair gets longer. But um, to maintain it at night, I put on a scarf to go over this part. And then I put over the bonnet on top of that. So when I wake up in the morning, I take off the bonnet. I take off the scarf and I can just get up and go. No more worrying about, you know, hair or anything like that. But as I go through and do styles to it, I'll give you guys, um, you know, some videos for styles. And if there's anything that anybody wants to know specifically, I didn't use anything. Again, um, in my previous video, I showed what kind of hair I've used. So be sure to check that out because if I tell you now, you won't go back and watch my other video. But um, I didn't do anything special. I just used the hair that I told you guys about. And that was it. You know, the pack of hair. I used two packs of hair. I thought I was going to need more, but I cut the hair in half, so this is two full packs of hair. I didn't have any left over, but this is two packs. Um, so that's it. I'm going to try and upload um, a video from what I did for my workout this morning um, and what I ate. Well, I could just, no, I'll do that in a video because I'm trying to get you guys to watch. So if I give it all to you in one video, you're not going to watch the rest of them. But um, I'm going to upload some more videos today um, on those things, the workout and what I ate and what I plan on eating. But this one is just the part two so you all can see how my hair came out after I finished it. And this is my alternative to the crochet braids. Still giving you that look of the crochet braids, but it's actually individual braids. So um, leave your comments with your feedback, any questions or anything. Let me know. All right, guys. Bye.